hello welcome to my youtube channel in today's video we are going to evaluate the question on the book which says that evaluate the integral of all square x dx if today is your first time of watching me then please consider subscribing to my youtube channel like and comment so come along as we find solution to this problem so remember from trigonometry and from Double angle for that matter. We say cos 2x is equal to cos square x minus sine square x. And this is gotten from compound angles. And also, we know that sine square x plus cos square x is equal to 1. So from this, we can say that our sine square x is equal to 1 minus cos square x. So, we can substitute sine square x into this and say that our cos 2x is equal to cos square x minus 1 minus cos square x. That is in place of sine square x we substitute 1 minus cos square x. So we can say cos 2x is equal to cos square x minus 1 plus cos square x. So our cos 2x is equal to cos square x plus cos square x will give us 2 cos square x minus 1. So, in making cos square x the subject, we can say that cos 2x plus 1 is equal to 2 cos square x. And we we'll divide both sides by 2. We can say our cos square x is equal to cos 2x plus 1 all over. So we have to identify that our cos square x is equal to cos 2x plus 1 all over 2. Then in place of cos square x ds, we can substitute that. So our problem, which is the integral of cos square x dx, can be rewritten as the integral of cos 2x plus 1 all over 2 dx so now our integral of cos 2x plus 1 all over 2 dx can be equal to the integral of half cos 2x plus 1 dx so we can factor out our half and say that this will be half the integral of cos 2x plus 1 dx. So since we are able to decompose our problem to this level, we can easily integrate this. Remember how to integrate trigonometric functions of this nature. We differentiate this and use it to divide the integral of cos. And repeat the angle so we can say that this the integral of this will be the integral of this when we integrate cos x we'll get sine x so we'll say sine x sine 2x so the integral of cos is sine so we we'll repeat the angle and use it to, and use the differential to divide that's the differential of 2x is 2 please check out my videos on how to integrate all this on YouTube. The integral of 1, that will be x, then plus our constant of integration. When we expand this, we get sine 2x over 4, that's when this multiply that, then plus half x plus c, which we can rewrite as half x plus sine 2x over 4 plus c. So we can conclude that the integral of cos 
square x dx is equal to half x plus sine 2x over 4 plus our constant of integration. I hope this will help someone. Please, if it does, remember to like, comment, and share my videos. This will make my YouTube channel grow more and I can record more mathematical content for you.